Okay, children. So, uh, our applications of trigonometry, Adi Sharma, we were discussing in last video. We did it one to ten children. In last video, we did one to ten. Now, we'll do eleven to twenty children. Eleven to twenty. Eleven to some. All of you check eleven to some children. What is eleven to some given? The shadow of a tower when the angle of elevation of sun is forty-five degrees is found to be ten meter longer than when it is at sixty. Children, at sixty. Because of the sun shadow will fall on children. This is there, no? The shadow will fall here, children. Because of the sun. When it is at sixty, okay. Let it be shadow is x. Let the shadow be x, okay. Then, when it is forty-five degrees, when it is forty-five degrees, this is also forty-five because of alternate angle. Sorry, for ninety degrees we should put. It is forty meters longer than the original. Than the original. It is 40 meters longer than 10 meters long. 10 meters longer than the original. Children, initial shadow is x when at 60 degrees. Okay, at 45 degrees, at 45 degrees, <coughs> the shadow is 10 meters longer. Shadow is 10 meters longer. Okay, so shadow is 10 meters longer. Okay, children, now fine. Tell me. Okay, in this case, in this case. What is tan 60? Samira, can you say what is tan 60 in this case? Sir? Tan 60 in this case. Um. Opposite by H sin. Tell me. H by um. H by X. Tan 45 in this case, opposite by adjacent. Can at least tell tan 45 here? Sir, H. H by 10 plus X. H by 10 plus X. So children, here, root 3 is equal to H by X. Here, 1 is equal to H by 10 plus X. This comes here, this goes here. So H is equal to how much here? Root 3 X. H is equal to 10 plus X. Okay. This will be put here and we solve the sum. Okay. So when you solve the sum like this, what happens is C here. This has been here. Root 3x is equal to 10 plus x. This comes here. Root 3x minus x is equal to 10 children. x should take common. Root 3 minus 1 is equal to 10 children. Then you bring this here. x is equal to 10 by root 3 minus 1. Some people are doing 10 by 1.732 minus 1, 10 by 0 0.73, like that you should never do, children. You should never do. Rest less than do the sum. Why, sir, what happens means, sir? Children, you should know what are the easy methods. That's what we are learning. 10 into root 3 plus 1 by, children, this is a minus b, this is a plus b, nothing but a square minus b square, root 3 whole square minus 1 square. So x is equal to 10 into root 3 plus 1 by 3 minus 1 is 2, 2 pi sir. So x is equal to 5 into root 3, root 3 plus 1 meters is one the answer. Okay, is x. Then he is asking what we have to find out children. We have to find out the height of the tower. We got x on each other till now. Okay, so what is x children? Well, I mean say what is h? h is root 3x. h is root 3x. So root 3, what is x children? 5. What is x children? 5. 5 into root 3 plus 1. Please try to understand children. So 5 root 3 into 3 children. Root 3 into root 3 is 3. 3 plus 15 plus 5 root 3 into 1 is 5. So children, try to understand. 15 plus 1.732 into 5. Okay, children. So 15 plus 5 to 10, 16, 35, 36, 8.660. So finally, what is the answer children? 23.660 meter is height of tower. Many people are not writing statement, very least bothered, not writing units, not doing simplification. However, you want you are doing children, that is not the method. Here, if you practice only in board exam, you get good marks children. Simply if you write do whatever you want, it will be same, uh, you will get same marks in the board exam also. Okay, children, those who didn't understand, check next question to us. A parachutist is descending vertically and makes angle of elevation 45 and 60 at two observing points 100 meters apart. 
children here a parachute is still there the parachute is still there children. okay parachute is just coming down okay okay parachutist is descending vertically and makes an angle of 45 degrees and 60 degrees from here he is making 60 degrees from here a person is saying he is making 45 degrees okay children a parachutist is descending vertically and makes an angle of elevation 45 and 60 at two observing points 100 meters apart from each other on the left side of himself this is 100 meters they both are 100 meters children. okay so question is what is the question children? what is the height of the parachutist i think that's all uh, where, where he falls which he falls and find the maximum height height also is asking and this distance so two people one fellow is seeing this parachutist at 60 degrees one fellow is seeing this parachutist at 45 degrees okay children so here we have one tan 60 we have and another one tan 45 we have children tan 60 is there tan 45 is there okay donisha can you say tan 60 is how much amma tan 60 sir uh, one second sir opposite adjacent h by x x tan 45 can you see for tan 45 forget this 60 is not there this is opposite this entire thing is adjacent tan 45 can you see tan 45 amma sir is the whole base 100 sir 100 plus x. No, this is 100. This is it. This is 100. This is 100. H by 100 plus x. This is opposite. This is adjacent. This is h. This is 100 plus x. Okay. So tan 60 is h by x. Tan 45 is h plus 100 plus x. 100 plus x. The distance between two people is 100. The distance between two people. Now, root 3 is equal to h by x and 1 is equal to h by x. 100 plus x h is equal to root 3 x 100 plus x is equal to h children substitute h here children what you get 100 plus x is equal to root 3 x bring this x here children 100 into root 3 x minus x children take x common what you get root 3 minus 1 x is equal to 100 by root 3 minus 1 go for rationalization root 3 plus 1 by root 3 plus 1 x is equal to 100 into root 3 plus 1 by a square minus b square is a minus b so x is equal to 50 into root 3 plus 1 this is x now we want height height is equal to children root 3 x means substitute here children so what you get pc children root 3 into 50 into root 3 plus 1 can anyone say root 3 into root 3 is how much children 3 3 3 350 is a 150. 50 root 3 to 1, 50 root 3 to 1. Okay, so h is equal to 150 plus 50 into 1.732. h is equal to 150 plus 5 to the 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 0, 86. So 150 plus 86. How much is that children? 236.8 meter is height of parachutist from the ground. From the ground. Sir, na ko two thirty six point six meters ano chindi sir. Aon na two thirty six point six sir. Six sir. Aon six sir. Aon na six sir. Hindi ka nito. Nito eight and half sir. Na pero much weight. Six. No problem. Okay children. Hindi ba kami? Yes. Why did we multiply root three x with fifty sir? Hindi ba? I don't understand. हाँ वो 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 � all of you get ready, children, and yeah, we ask the yeah. question. On the same side of the tower, two objects are located. When observed from the top of the tower, the angles of depression are 45 and 60 degrees. 45 and 60 degrees. The angles of depression, children. One is 60, so this is also 60. One is 45, so this is also 45. Okay. On the same side, he is asking. 
okay on the same side for children see here on the same side of tower two objects are located uh, their angles of depression are 45 if the height of the tower is 150 find the distance between the objects this is 150 children he's asking find the distance between the objects means we should find out why children we should find out why we should find out why children okay we get ready now who will tell rohan with that rohan tan 60 and the tan 45 and the man 150 by x very good very good 150 by y plus x x plus y simplification chapter one india says call tell me this comes here this root 3x is equal to 150 150 by root 3 x plus y is equal to 150 rest let's say you want root 3 into root 3 so x is equal to root 3 to root 3 is 3 3 to 3 is 50 root 3 what this if you substitute here you will get y so children 50 root 3 plus y is equal to 150 bring this here children y is equal to 150 minus 50 root 3 so y is equal to 150 minus 1.732 into 50 so y is equal to 150 minus 1635 times 6 86.6 y is equal to 150 minus 86.6 how much children y is equal to 150 minus 86.6 is how much children 63.4 63.4 meter is distance between two points okay now children between two points 63.4 meters okay children so tan 60 is for only h by x children and 45 is for, for what children? And 45 is h by x plus y children. You should know how to make children. If you don't know, you'll get confusion. For you people, I'm saying so many sums. Try to understand children. You have to practice. Full in sum children. Full in sum. Full in sum. The angle of observation of top of tower from same level of uh, foot uh, foot of the tower is that the angle of elevation of top of tower from point on the same river foot of tower is 30 degrees children this is tower 30 degrees angle of elevation is 30 degrees okay angle of elevation on advancing 150 meters it is 60 degrees one fellow he came 150 meters suspended. again he saw now it is 60 degrees okay this is x this is h Okay, children, you have to find out what is the height of the tower. That's all. Okay, children. So, tan 60 is there. It's less, sir. And tan 30 degrees is there, children. We have to find out. Uh, we have to find out both, children. Okay. So, sir, I can you move your camera towards left? Okay, children. Now, who will tell? <coughs> I will ask. Whomever I ask, you should say, children. Uh, who will tell me, sir? Sanjay will say, Sanjay tan 60, tan 60. Yes, sir. Tan 60 is equal to opposite by adjacent. Tell them how much? H by X, sir. Tan 30. Madhyam 60 layer on Tan 30 is how much? H by? 150 plus X. Oh, super, super. Can you say how much is tan 60, Nana? H by X. 1 by root 3 is equal to H by 150 plus X. Can anyone say simplification? How to do? Anyone? Sir, physically. X is equal to 3x. 150 plus x is equal to 3x. Okay. Okay, mute your audience. Mute your audience. So, children, in this topic, I put root 3x. So, 150 plus x is equal to root 3 to root 3x. 150 is equal to 3x. So, x is equal to. So x is equal to 75. Now I want the height much of root 3 into 75. Can anyone do calculation and tell me 1.73 into 75? 75. How much is the height of the tower? 1.73 into 75. Keep calculating. Ah. 9. 9.9. 9 meters is the height of the tower. Is the Height of tower children, uh, compulsory magnitude, units, and statement is important. Children. 
children and draw this pencil and scale for my pages for all the values children and try to do meet the children compulsory or right statement if not i will not accept okay one more question one more question 15th one 15th one uh, the angle of elevation of top of tower is observed from the point on horizontal plane to the foot of tower is 32 degrees so children this we i will tell how to do because a lot of calculations will involve mm. children from here it is 32 degrees children 32 degrees okay when the observer moves towards the tower distance of 100 meters is moving here and again he is seeing the top children at an angle of elevation of at an angle of elevation of 63 degrees children 63 degrees all right question find the height of the tower okay children find the height of the tower children can anyone say what is tan 32 H, H by, by 100, 100 plus X. H by 100 plus X. Anyone say tan 63 how much children? H by, H by X. X. H by X. Okay. So children tan 32 value how much you give children tan 32? 0.6248. He gave children the question. 0.6248 is equal to H by 100 plus X. He gave value children. And tan 63 how much he gave? 1.9626. 1.9626 is equal to h by x. So this you bring here h is equal to 100 plus x into 0.6248 and here h is equal to 1.9626x. This h you will put here. Okay. So how much you get 1.9626x is equal to this into this how much? 62.48 plus this into this is 0.6248x children bring this here 62.48 is equal to 1.9626x minus 0.624x 62.48 is equal to can anyone see subtraction <sighs> children this is a was sort of calculation actually uh, 1.9626 0.6424 Zero point three two zero two x children. So x is equal to sixty two point four eight by zero point. So you wrote zero point six two four, but in calculation you wrote six four two four. Six four shit. Six two four. Six two four. Zero. So how much is six eight three? Just only that is very happy. Three three eight six. 3386 so 0.3386 children can anyone say calculator using calculator how much is this by this children anyone have calculator find out this value and tell me 62.48 by 0 0.3386 fast children sir 186.618877 180. 180. Any one of you say on that? 184.5. 184.5. Okay. Now we got this is x children. Now h is equal to h is equal to we have 1.9626x. So can anyone do calculation 1.9626 into this one? What is that? 184.5. Tell me now. No, no. Use calculator and tell me fast is height of tower in exam we have to do, uh, do normally children sir 362.09 362.09 one of you keep calculator ready children okay please one of you keep calculator ready okay 16 this one children 16 this one whomever i ask they have to say children they have to compulsory they have to answer whether you know or not just at least open your mouth the angle of elevation of top of tower from point a and the ground is 30 degrees from point A on the ground, the angle of elevation of this tower is 30 degrees. The angle of elevation on the ground is 30 degrees. Okay. On moving the distance 20 meters towards, angle changes to 60. Someone kept 20 meters towards, now angle changes to 60. Okay. Same question again and again, again and again. We have to look. Okay. Whomever I ask, they have to say. Satya, can you say how to do this? Time? Tan 30, how much? Satya? Sir. Tan 30. Tan 20. 10, 30, 20 plus x, h by 20 plus x. Very good, 10, 60. 
Round to three. H by X. Okay, and that is how much? Root three, one by root three. And 60 is how much? Root three. It's for X. This if it comes here, H is equal to? H is equal to root three X. 70 plus X is equal to? Mm. Root three H. Substitute this here and tell me. 70 plus X is equal to? Root three into root three into X. 20 plus X is for how much? 3 into x. 20 plus 20 is equal to? 2x. x is equal to? x is equal to 10. Very good. Now you are saying very nice. Root 3 into 10 is how much? Mm. Root 3, 10. 10 root 3. That means 17.32 meters. 1.73 you should do the question. Okay. So like this you have to do. Very good now. Satya, you really told very nice. Thank you, sir. Yes, ma'am. 17. Sir. See now, everyone should answer like that. 17, sir. From top of building 15 meter high, the angle of elevation of top of tower, 150 meter building is there, Shiva. 150 meter building is there. Someone is seeing tower. Someone is seeing the tower. From top of the building, he's seeing like this. Shiva. From top of tower, from top of <coughs> building 50 meter, angle of elevation of top of tower is found to be 30 degrees. Shiva. Someone is seeing top of tower from here, it is 30 degrees. Shiva. 30 degrees, see here. And from the bottom of the same building, the angular variation of top of this tower only 60 degrees. From here, if you see, it is 60 degrees. Excuse me, sir. Yeah, no, no. Sir, last question they asked us to find a distance also, sir. Okay, no, you find out. I found out, no, no. I say you found out. You find it. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. Yeah, okay, no. okay, children. Now, in the small, small things, you can find out, no? Seven minute question. So, find the height of tower and distance between the tower and the building. From now onwards, we'll go forward, okay? So, if this is 15 children, this is also 15. Let us take this as H and let us take this as B. If this is B children, this is also B. There are two triangles. One is small triangle children. One is small triangle like this. This is H and this is 30 and this is B. And one is big to triangle children. Big to triangle. Okay, that is 60. And this entire thing is 15 plus H by B children. Okay. Now, whoever asks, they have to say okay. Now, who will tell me, sir? Riddhi will tell. Riddhi, can you tell me? Okay, sir. Tan 30 is H by B. Okay, H by B. H by B. Okay. Tan 60 is 15 plus H by B. Okay. Tan 30 is 1 by root 3 is equal to H by B. Okay. Tan 60 is root 3 by 50 is equal to 15 plus H by B. B is yeah. equal to root 3 H. Okay. Root 3 B is equal to 15 plus H. Can I substitute B here, Amma? Yes, sir. Tell Amma. 15 plus H is equal to 3 into 3. Root 3 to root 3 is 3. 3, 3, B. 3 B. This if it comes here, 15 is equal to? 15 is equal to 2 B. 2 H. H, H is equal to? 7.5. Only H is 7.5. Total height of the tower I want. 15 plus 7.5. Very good, Nana. Very good. Super, you are saying. So, 22.5 meters is height of tower. Now, what is the base? B. B. Only B I want. Base. Distance between building and tower. Root 3 into H. How much we got? 7.5. 7.5. Don't take this. Only H you should take. Uh, how much am I? Sir, 1 point. Can, I, seven, three, two. can anyone help me with calculator? Can anyone help me with calculator? 1.73 means 7. Sir, 12.99. Thank you, Nana. 12.99 meters is the distance between the building and tower. Okay, Chena. Very good, Nana. You really told very nicely. Thank you, sir. Next, Chena. See, Chena, like that, you have to participate. If you don't participate, what is happening? Only three, four good students are telling, remain all are just sitting. I'm not saying you are not good. You are, because I'm not asking, you are not telling. Anyone? On the horizontal plane, there's a vertical tower with a flag. Children on horizontal plane, there is a vertical tower with a flag. Okay, vertical tower with a flag. Okay. Uh, at, at a point 9 meters away from the foot of the tower, the angle of elevation of the top of bottom of the flags are 60 and 30. At 9 meters distance from the foot. Top is 60 and bottom is 30. Question is, question is children, find the 
height and distance uh, find the angle of elevation uh, height of the tower and uh, a flag this x we should find by also this also the uh, height of the tower and height of the flag or pole or whatever it is okay so children some i last time jyotsna with and jyotsna jyotsna yes sir there are two triangles amma see here one is wicket triangle 60 with this is 9 this is x plus y and there is a small triangle amma there is a small triangle this is x sir this is 9 this is 30 tell amma this is tan 60 how much उंड height of flag chal height of flag only height of flag now here we should do 1.732 into 6 and here we can do 1.732 into 3 that you can do it i know so you have to find out the final answers and you have to find the answer that's it like that chal chal and where your individual license join the free lecture and appreciate in the small points and find the main The main equation. Once main equation is written, the main all thing is solution algebra option. Here and here option. Main diagram is important. How do you construct a diagram? That is very very important. If you don't know diagram, it's very difficult. That's why I'm showing so many sums. How many sums you practice? That much important. Two worksheets. Um, day before yesterday I sent one picture. Today I sent one picture. All those sums try to draw figures on your own and check my video. Whether your figure and my figure is matching. If it is matching, you are correct. If not, you have to rectify your answers. Main question. Like a tree breaks and broken bends at the top of the ground at an angle of 30 degrees. Children, tree is there. This is like they show some more. Tree is there. It is breaking at some point and falling at 30 degrees to the ground. Children, okay. Don't forget about 90 degrees. Okay, uh, the distance between the foot of the tree and the point of the contact is eight meters. Find the height of that. This is like this is nine eight meters. Okay, is asking height. Height means you have to find out x, and you also should find out y. X plus y is the height of that. Okay, children. For finding x, what we will use, children? Opposite by adjacent. Sign. Tan x by adjacent. For finding y. Adjacent by hypotenuse. Who will give adjacent by hypotenuse? Cos. 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 Theta. That's it. Okay. Here you should find x. Here you should find out y. Once you know x and y, you can find out x plus y is the height. Okay, children. One by root three is equal to x by eight. As this comes here, x is equal to eight by root three. And in the same way, root three by two is equal to eight by two. Y is equal to this comes here. This goes down. Sixteen by two. Now the total height of the tree is x plus y. Now we will see. So height of the tree is x plus y. That is eight by root three plus sixteen by root three. How much is that, children? Twenty-four by root three. Eight plus. Now go for crystallization. Root three by root three. That is twenty-four by root three by eight. So eight root three. That is one point seven three two. Eight sixteen by eight point eight six meters. That is thirteen point eight six meters.
From point B on the ground, <coughs> the angle of elevation of 10 meter building is 30 degrees. Children, tell the 10 meter building, children. Okay. From here, it is 30 degrees. Children. From here, it is 30 degrees. Point B on the ground. Okay. Now, a flag is hoisted on the top of the building, and the angle of elevation of top of the flag is 40 degrees. Okay. From the top of the side, or here. Okay. What is the question? Question will be what is the height of the flag? What is the base? Both of you can know what you know that is it. Okay. Who will tell this? Who will tell this? They should say, okay. Now, who will tell me? Uh, we'll give you the chance to. Ishan, you want to have try, Nana? Ishan, you want to try? If you want to try, I will ask. If not, because. Sir, I will try, sir. Okay, this is 45. I'm telling you, this is H plus 10. This is V. And one more small one I need. Right? This is 30. This is 10 by V. Yeah, tell them. Tan 45 is how much? Sir, tan 45 is equals to H, H plus 10 by V. Okay, tan 30 is how much? Amma? Sir, 10 by V. Very good. Can you tell me the solution? Yes, sir. What? Sir, tan 45 equals to 1. It goes to H plus 10 by V. Sir, H, H plus 10 is equals to V. Okay. And this will be tan 30 equals to 1 by root 3 is equals to 10 by B cross multiplication. B is equals to root 3, 10, sorry, 10 root 3. Put here, man. Put here. 10, uh, 10, okay. Okay, man. Tell 10 into root 3 minus 1. 10 into 1.732 minus 1. H is equals to 10 into 0 0.732. H is equal to 7.32 meters. Okay. So, the height of flag stuff is 7.32 meters. No, base. Base already we got it. See here. Base already we got it. Base is how much? 10 into? 1.732. That is? Base is equal to 17.32 meters. Yeah. That's it. And then base. This is base amount. From here to here. And this is this much. You have to write statement also. Statement, statement. This is how we have to do the sums, children. I hope you understood. Some more sums will do tomorrow, children. And what I will do is I will give the, I, uh, 